yo, Frankie, yo, your videos, like, aren't that good, but, like, you should make a vlog to try to connect with your audience because you never have before. Your audience doesn't even know who you are. And, oh, by the way, your videos also suck. Again, like, you're only, you're only known for one video, and it's been copied, like, a billion times, so, really, you're nothing. <laughs> it's like, hey, guys, this video is called When You're 18. I'm gonna try to vlog because I haven't done it in literally a year. So here we go. So this year I lost some friends of mine and whether it was due to girls or whether it was due to um, just other complications and such, I lost people in my life. Maybe it shows they weren't your real friend in the first place and that it was never meant to be. And yeah, um, this year was also definitely the most fun year of my life um, thus far anyway. It was my senior year of high school pretty much and I just partied pretty much. I didn't do anything like work wise it was very easy. Um, you know getting into college wasn't that hard and it was just not that big of a deal. People seemed to be very stressed out senior year like applying to colleges. I took it slow you know I started in the beginning of the year applied to colleges got things done had a blast in high school met people that I never thought I'd met in my entire life that I, I would meet this year more than any other year I've met just incredible people people that like I love and like I hold dearly to me um, so yeah one thing I've definitely overcome was my boredom I was it just a stupid person who kind of like walked the halls of high school and walked the halls of like life I guess and I just kind of went through life like letting things push me around and not really doing anything about it and then I was like you know let me get out of this dumb comfort zone and then I started kind of having like a great time and that was just because I kind of just started talking to new people and whatnot and not hanging around the same people every single day and it was just like really refreshing I guess something I'm very sad about is that I've seen my passions die down this year I worked harder than ever than I ever have on YouTube but still that wasn't enough like it wasn't a lot I know people who post sometimes three times a week and meanwhile I'm posting once a week sometimes once a month and that's just for lack of a better word just lame <laughs> I'm happy with the choices that I've made but I need to work harder and that's always the thing is like in a lot of you know people's like stories and lives is work harder work harder work harder I have to say though I've never been more like thankful because this time last year when I made when you're 17 I had probably 300 subscribers and now I'm at 9,300 subscribers so that's just like one of the coolest things in the entire world I finally have a light to shine like somewhere to show like a little bit of creativeness that I have and I like doing that Woo -woo. Woo -woo. another thing that I learned when I was 18 is just to completely ignore your acne and that's super hard and I still struggle with it like there's I have acne all over my face of course I get pretty bad acne and I just kind of have been really learning to just ignore it. There's times where I literally didn't want to go to school because of how like bad I thought I looked and that was just ridiculous. Um, people don't really judge you on your acne. They don't unless they're just stupid, unless they just, they're uncaring people, um, like just dumb people. I don't, I, don't, I don't have a better word for that. but. Acne doesn't matter. Everybody gets acne. Everybody has, like, has breakouts. Well, not everybody. Some people have perfect skin, but a lot of people do. And like, I just kind of share that bond with everybody else. Like, hey, we're breaking out together, man. Let's just get through this. I learned to really actually act on adventure instead of just saying, guys, like, go out and venture. Like, it'd be like so cool. Like, you should open up your mind. Like, go adventure. It'd be like really cool and stuff like that. I actually did that. We, me and my friends, we went to countless abandoned buildings. Um, you know, hospitals and, you know, abandoned stuff like that and just explored the hell out of it. I have so much footage from that. I'm trying to put into some kind of video, but I don't know, even know what to do. Um, yeah. One time, snuck up to a skyscraper in New York City, which was probably the number one thing that we did. It was insane the way we did it and we just got so lucky, like, like passing people and it was just super, super fun. Super, probably shouldn't be talking about this, but it was a great, great time. It's kind of crazy to think, because this year a lot of people, you know, like all of my best friends moved off to college, and um, it was just kind of crazy seeing where to go. So I think the time spent with them was definitely, you know, something I'll never forget. And obviously, the time is not done being spent. You know, I still visit my friends in college and stuff like that, and I don't know. I don't know where I'm going with this. Just value your friendships. <laughs> uh, something kind of sad actually happened. So I don't know if you guys ever seen this video. Uh, it's called Another Day in Paradise. It's on my channel. It's one of my favorite videos on my channel because it actually puts together really well and I edited it like I spent actual like real time like, editing that instead of just rushing through it and I thought it came together pretty nice this friend group is barely a friend group anymore it's just like kind of like we talk to each other and like there's people over here there's people over here there's people over here it's kind of sad to see things go like that but I guess that's kind of how like 
maybe the world the way it's supposed to be. I, I don't know. But that's what it kind of goes back into. Value your friendships. Value your friends. Keep your friends close. Um, yeah. Just love people. I don't know. Don't get mad at things. People joke, you know? People joke around. And it might offend you. Don't get triggered. Just take it as it is. Laugh at it. Ignore it. Push it off. We don't have time to be mad and angry and, and, and annoyed. Life is so short. Life is so short. So, like literally, it's f***ing short. <laughs> it's short. <laughs> we get it. Frankie. Woo. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys next week.